Hello everybody and welcome back to Sky Factory 3. My name is Wolfhard and uh, we've got a lot of chickens. So we set this guy up last time with this uh, giant chest and the ranged collector. Progression, 1%. Okay. Uh, check this out. We've got so much stuff in there already. <laughs> it's insane. Alright, so. Today we're going to be working on two things. One is we're going to work on Batania. We're going to go ahead and pop this guy out here. I've been doing a little bit of work on collecting flowers. Just a little. Um, you'll also notice I have this bag of holding. I did do a little bit of work to get that. Always good to have one of those. Um, we're going to go into the nether, but first we need to make some tools. So, we got the steel chicken, and one of the first things we're going to end up making, take a bunch of steel, one of the first things I want to make is arrows. Swap that out, put you in there, what's the cost on that? Two. Why does everything say progression, one percent? <sighs> said two, right? Two. Okay. Apparently, I can't melt that back down. Mm, whatever. I'll just throw it in here. So, that'll give us that. We also want to make a pick and a matic. Let's see, that's two, four, six. And we're going to make a bow out of... I don't know my sugar cane. Oh yeah, I used it. <laughs> I'm like, where is all my sugar cane? I only had nine, so I had to use it. Go ahead and get that porn. Now we're going to make this guy, these arrow shaft patterns. Perfect amount. Uh, breakable, eh, I can work with that. So we'll put that in there. We have to make some fletching, which we have lots of feathers. Can I have please? No. We're just going to take them right back. Uh, fletching. See, this is this is why I like setting it up like this, because I can actually click on that one and go straight over here. And it's not where you go. It's because you went to the wrong place. There we go. You got steel arrows. They're actually pretty cool. They got 100% accuracy and an attack of 9. And we have 101 ammo. Not bad. Not bad. Wait, I do need to make a tool forge. Which means we'll take all of that. Where it is? There it is. Do I have three of these? I don't think I do. I do not. I'll have to make three. Uh, what does it take? It is a lot. I think it's what? Two per brick? So it takes eight per block, and I need three blocks? I don't know. We'll find out in a second. But we're going to need that. We're going to need. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we gotta make some stuff in here. We can't make these out of anything super cheap anymore because I don't have any paper. Uh, let's see, what should we make these out of? Probably just make them out of iron. And we'll get a uh, steel tool rod for everything as well.
So that's for the tool rods. And these... Wrong one. These are what? One each? Yeah. I think the Matic does not require one. But we also need to make a better sword. I made this one. It's a, a bone sword. It's got pretty low durability and low attack. So we're going to make a better one as well. So let's see. Sword. Actually, I'm going to go for a broad sword. Or a really large sword. I'll have to figure out how much I have of this stuff in here. Two ingots. Okay, so it's a one to one. That means I need 12 of them, and this was 7. Twelve. And our steel is here. Okay. Go ahead and make pickaxe head. We'll get out the shovel and the axe. I like how you can actually see them cooling now. Come on. There we go. Uh, we're also going to make these guys. Oh, they cost three each. So we'll need to put six steel in there. Oh. Let's uh, do the other ones first. Tool rods. And... Binding. Now, we're actually going to make a... Uh, a longbow. Which is a bit harder to make because it does require the tool forge. Did that all melt down? Perfect. Give me that. Come on. One. That'll give me two. Meanwhile, we can put these together. So, big X. We'll make it with steel. And... Matic. Multi-purpose tools, and they have pretty good stats on them. Durability of 659, mining speed 7. We can always modify them, so I'm not too worried about that. What else do we have? Sword. I want to make a steel sword with an iron guard on it. Uh, that guy's expensive. I actually need, need, need to make this uh, tool forge before we do that. So I know exactly what we need. Okay. And I will do... I was about to say, did I lose some in there? No, not there. We'll do all that. So I want to make a... A cleaver? Yeah, I think we'll make a cleaver. Which means we need two large... We need a large plate. Large sword blade. And two tough tool rods. So that's eight. We'll make. Oh, we got lots of steel, so I'm not worried about it. So that's for that. The tool rods, I believe, are three. Yeah. Not the bones. One, two, three. And we'll come back to make the plate. 
So let's see, we got the Bolim in there, right? Bolim. We got steel. Means one. Come on. I was hoping this wouldn't take as long, but we're making some really good tools here. Or at least decent tools. Two. Put you away. Now we're going to take this obsidian. And I need a little bit of string. So we can make a bow string. We're going to make this guy. Okay, that's going to take a second. In the meantime, I need to go get eight more obsidian. I did set this guy up down here. He's an obsidian generator. There we go. It's also my lava generation right now. I might move it over to the other side where the, uh, underneath the smeltery so I can just pipe up some fluid to the, smel the smeltery. Oh! That only used four. So I don't need any more. Awesome! That saves me some time. Uh, longbow. Plate. So a steel longbow with a bonus damage of nine. <laughs> I was using this thing and I was one-shotting everything. So, I'm not too worried about the fact that it takes forever to draw. Well, let's make this uh, cleaver. Get rid of some stuff. Oh my gosh, we have so much junk. He's been ticking me off. I actually smacked him because he was annoying me. He doesn't want to breed with the right people. Got all that. Take that out. Tough tool rod. Do I have the cleaver one in here? I do. I don't need that. Let's get two of those. We have the plate. Oh, don't do that. As far as I can tell, I can't fix that if I do it. Cleaver. I should make a battle sign. <laughs> That'd be hilarious, just to make a battle sign. I've actually never played with the cleaver, so that's kind of why I wanted to make it. And... Look at that attack, 12.56. This thing is gigantic, too. Look at the size of that. It's as big as I am. Alright, so. Let's get this portal set up somewhere. And we'll quickly make a flint and steel. I don't think I have one. Let me check to make sure I don't. Nope. Okay, so we got that. We're gonna make it... Here. Because I don't feel like trying to find anywhere else to put it. Uh, I don't have any other blocks. Put that away for a second. Don't I have some... Yes, I do. I have wood. We'll build it. We'll build wood around it. Two. Three.
Guess I don't need you anymore. Or you. Hehehe. <laughs> One, two. Boom! Nether. Now, before we go in there, I need to grab two things. Let's do this here. I have no idea how this stuff works. It's supposed to be a chicken bait, and I have no idea. That's not what I need. What I need is a whole stack of that. I need that on my hotbar. And I need to switch, put this stuff away. Okay, so, we're going into the nether. Finally, only well, halfway through the video. <laughs> there we go. Now, in my free play one, I was lucky enough. I spawned in and, hey! How convenient! That is actually, like, super convenient. Let's see if I can do this from here. So it's got 100% accuracy. Let's see if I can hit one of these blades. I think I actually do have to aim up a little. Oh, it's aiming a little to the left. No? Yeah, let's try this. Direct. Oh yeah! That's why I love this thing. I can one shot damn near anything over there. Alright, so let's put a little platform. We'll do slabs so we can get farther. I did not bring a uh a thing with me. But I have sticks. And that means I can make... Can I make one out of steel? No. Of course not. Can I do with a stone wand? I have no idea how this... uh This chicken bait works. And I guess we'll find out. We're just going to build a platform way out. Looks like that's a pretty big fortress over there too. Okay, let's see how this thing works. There's no water in this area. Yeah, okay, that's not going to work at all here. Yeah, fail. Uh, last time I actually had to go to the fortress to get a to get a quartz chicken. So, let's see if we can make our way over there. I'm going to kill off most of the stuff that's there first. I'll leave the skeletons. Hello, bye, magma slime. <laughs> I was about to tell you hi, but you kind of went off in your own direction. Oh, that one didn't hit. I think that's just added or out of range. Oh, wow. I'm out of slabs already. I'm going to make my way over there. I'm going to build a little bit of a platform to get down. <laughs> and I will see you guys once I get there. How convenient. <laughs> this is the chicken I'm looking for. <laughs> I just got over here. And yeah. Built this long uh, anti gas tunnel <laughs> to get over here. And it's like, hey, chicken. There's a blaze spawner right there, too. Don't really need it. Alright. Actually, I'm kind of curious. Does this thing work on the blaze spawner? I don't think it does. I think the like the diamond one actually works on them. Dog, why are you barking? Oh, we got the chicken we needed. We are out of here. Now I will start bringing up a whole ton of chickens off camera. Because I need a lot of them. But now that we got the nether quartz chicken, we can get glass. Which means we can get diamond. And emerald. And enderpearl. Oh, 
You need to be in here. You're not ready yet. All right, so now we're gonna jump into Batania. Now that I got that going, uh, you can see all the stuff I used. <laughs> what am I doing? I have trash in my inventory. Let's throw all that away. Withered dust, I think I need that for something. Throw that stuff away, I don't need it. Don't need that. Oh, I need that. Yeah, there we go. Put you guys in there. And, ooh, we got a dirt pot. I'm gonna have to make some more apple juice. Run a little low on apples. Ooh, maybe I should build a carrot farm. Carrot juice is always good, too. Alright, so, what can we actually use this for? Dark sugar. I can use it to make soul sand. Okay. I didn't know I could do that. I can also use the atomic reconstructor and some power to make soul sand, but... Whatever. Alright, so... Let's go ahead and get our bucket out. We're gonna make a little bit of an infinite water source over at the Batania area. So I don't have to keep running all the way over here. Hmm... Let's get some slabs. I don't have any... I have one stone slab in here. I got this quartz enriched iron from something too. I don't remember what. I think it was in a loot bag. Okay, there we go. We can now make a infinite water source over here for Batania. Three! It'll also double as a uh, hydrangea point for once we get to those. Water. I forgot I can do that. This is 1.10. <laughs> we actually have that. <laughs> Double death. Alright, so... Can I actually do something with that? Or does it just move? Eh, whatever. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That works. Alright, so... Get started over here. Eh, put that here. Put apothecary. We need white. And we need seeds. Luckily, we have a large area or a large farm that's producing seeds galore. That's not where they are. So I think it's just, what, like one white petal? I should make a Lexica Batania. <laughs> I know I have the stuff to make that. I don't have the stuff to make that. Because I need... I need paper. <laughs> okay. I think I can just do this. Ah, pure daisy. What are you? It's four petals. Okay, never mind. I'm I'm okay. That'll get us started. I'll get uh, some materials going. I'll get some stuff going. So, four petals. Just know what I wanted to do with that. Give me that. And... Awesome, we have a pure daisy. Pop you right there. And I don't have any of the other stuff on me. Hooray! We can get started in Batania. I'll probably do a lot of this off camera. I'm still very much learning Batania. But I gotta wait for some sugar cane to grow so I can get some paper. And I need a leather. I don't think I have any more leather on me. And I think I can use that atomic reconstructor and some rotten flesh to get some leather. So, I don't have any rotten flesh either. Shoot. Okay, I need one of those. I guess I'll face off with some zombies, or I'll go to the nether and kill some pig zombie to get some leather. 
that is going to be it for this time, guys. It's probably a little bit shorter than normally normal, but I got a lot of work to do. I'm going to do it all, a lot of it off camera. Do I have seeds on me? I do. You. Breed. Please. With the right chicken. Thank you. Now we're at a 323. Three, three. Perfect. Nether quartz. Awesome. And you. Are the last gen over here for the blues. Okay. That guy needs to go to the other side. Perfect. Getting a lot of chickens over here. Luckily we have a good sized storage area for all their stuff. So, like I said, that's it for this time, guys. I will see you guys next time. Now, and we got an Enderman head. So we'll need those two. Hello, Enderman. Come here.